You're new. If it's training you want, we don't just take anyone. I'd appreciate training with a master such as yourself, but that's not why I'm here. Oh! King Pafsanias asked me to bring the Pankration champion to Elise. Forgive me. I didn't know a royal messenger was coming. I'm Alcon, Testicles trainer. Cassandra, of Sparta. If I may offer some advice before you get him, Testicles can be... difficult. A gift of oil is known to put a person on his good side. Oil? A muscle rub. He believes it imbues him with the power of Heracles. Look in the village of Githion. His favorite merchant is there. Winning the wreath is important for Sparta. You think he can do it? The other day he knocked out six men and a bull. And he only went to the market to buy fruit. That's why I had to send him to the island. Where can I find your champion? I sent Testicles to train on a small island in the Bay of Hades. It's good for him there, isolated, away from people. Look for the shipwreck of Nestor on the southern shore. Can you tell me anything about Pankration? It's a mix of boxing and wrestling, a fearsome test of skill. Champions come from the farthest corners of the world to compete in Olympia, but not all walk away. I can't wait to see it. I need to get this champion of yours to Elise. I hope he lives up to your promise. Oh, he will. Look for his camp on the southernmost island in Messinia. Good luck. I should get that oil. Anything that'll make it easier to get testicles to the Olympics. Spartans can build as many boats as they like. Poseidon will never favor them as he does the Athenians. I see her. Move! Closed. I need oil, then I'll be on my way. There's a special one that uh, Testicles uses. Ah, for Pankration fighters. That one has to be made fresh by the Master, and he's gone. I'm not leaving without it. You don't understand. I'm nearly free. You're a slave? Yes, and in a good position. Doing this would be stealing from him. I know I'm asking for a lot, but I need this oil now. I could come back and talk to your master. Maybe explain the situation? What choice do I have? It's not bad, this life, if I have to stay. I'll give you the recipe, but that's as far as I go. You make it yourself. I can do that. Ah, light a fire and gently heat oil of Athena. This will aid the infusion. Once the oil is warm, add a rose petal. And it's done. Thank you. I hope it's worth my freedom. 
Let's see if I can get this right. It had to be heated. Now, what oil did I need? This one. The oil of Athena. I'll take some of this. Almost done. Now, to add... For the final touch, a rose petal. The testicles will smell so good. I hope he appreciates this. Oh, it smells so good, I almost want to keep it for myself. What do you want from the great champion Testicles? Can't you see I'm busy? I'm here to take you to the Olympics. Olympics? Fuck yeah! I'm going to be the champion. <laughs> champion! Cause I Testicles! Good. Let's set sail. Oh no! Can't possibly go now. Training, see? And I don't know if I'm up to going sailing on your booty. I have something for you. A certain oil. My oil? Oh, I could kiss you. No, you couldn't. Here's your oil. Take it. Oh. Just like Mater used to make. Will you rub it on? God, no. Get on the boat. To the Olympics! The people need me! Well, we going? <sighs> He'd better fucking win. Testicles, it's an honor to sail with you. Your victory at the Pythian Games is legendary. Yes, I am! What made you kick him in the head instead of going for a grapple? Sounds like it. Ah, improvisation. Keep your opponent off guard. I see something! Strategies for people who don't hit hard enough. Nika! I'm gonna win! Are you excited for the games, Cassandra? Well... Stand down! Woo! Stand, warrior, stand. Feet firmly planted. Even in sand, our spirits soar on high. The Spartan never took a dance. Huh? It's a poem. A Spartan poem. Oh. Spartan! Woo! <laughs> Welcome to the Olympic Games! The party has officially begun! Alcibiades, I'm uh, surprised you're wearing clothes. The day is young, little goat.
Are you here to compete, Alcibiades? Of course. I enjoy other physical exertions from time to time. <laughs> Sure. Who do you think will win the most wreaths this year? I will! Athens will surely rise to the occasion. I say Messenia! Has the sea air addled your mind? Sparta always takes Pancratio, and many others too. You might know a lot about the past, but you know little about the future. Who's that? That is Thoryevs, the reigning champion. He's bloodthirsty, competitive, and has endurance to spare. Jealous? I don't think so. We haven't come all this way to stand on the dock. Quite right. Should you ever need a personal sparring partner... You? A skinny little Athenian? I'm the champion! Or gonna be? Sparta! <laughs> oh, a pity your brain isn't as big as your muscles. Let's get going. I need to be oiled before I go to the games. Well, I would have been happy to assist if you were in any state to compete. I likes to be oiled. Well, that's obvious. Yeah. You know us. Oh. Come here. Gives us a hug. <laughs> <laughs> Surely he can swim. Well, it looks like you're the champion now. I can't believe he's gone. Unprecedented. And you want me to compete in the Olympics? Stepping into a dead man's sandals? And testicles isn't even digested yet. Oh, come, dear Cassie. Show them what you're made of. And show me while you're at it. Where do I go to fight in the Pankration? The stadium in Olympia, naturally. I do love a good rough and tumble. You know people die in these events. What else goes on, apart from the Pankration? There's javelin. Which, of course, you know how that works. The athlete thrusts the long, smooth spear forward. Yes, I know. And then there's the foot races and the horse races. Sweat everywhere. A delight for the eyes and the nose. I need that wreath for Sparta. If it means I have to compete, so be it. The event doesn't start just yet. We could look around first. Olympia at Truce is quite extraordinary. Talk to him. I'm here for the Pankration. You must be joking. The only fighter we're missing is Testicles. He's a little under the water. I mean, weather. I'm the one taking his place. Okay, okay. Save it for the fight. This is unprecedented. But the crowd will riot if the Pankration is cancelled. Very well. The competition begins shortly. Time to go.
Welcome all! It is my pleasure to introduce to you Kalias, a former champion here in the stadium. And now, an esteemed judge here in Olympia. My friends, it is an honor for me to introduce this event, one so close to my heart. The Pankration! I will not delay you with words, for we all want to see action! For Zeus, let the competition commence! Ha ha ha! I'll squish you like a bag! That's not fair! This is hard! That was your best? That was but the beginning! What? Now that our contestant is warmed up, let's see what she can do against... Erasto! Good luck! Don't blink, or you will be seeing stars! Crowd loves you, but you're not done yet. Not done? A fine offering to the gods, wouldn't you say? Soon we will return for the final contest. The mighty Cassandra against our reigning champion, Thoriavs! <sighs> Astounding! To think I could be a companion to an Olympic champion! Oh, you're even better at sparring than I am. Will you just move? Though, if Socrates were a more willing a partner... Alcibiades, are you all right? I was with my friends, Dimophanes and Callias, respected Olympic judges, no less. Too much cheap wine? You look like you drank from Medea's cup. Medea's cup? You think he's been poisoned? You were celebrating? It's the Olympics. What's not to celebrate? We were at the Leonidaeon. If you've been poisoned, I need to find these judges. Poison? Do you think that they could be two, or...? No, never. They're good men. You can't think one of them. They host a celebration every Olympics to celebrate the sacred truce. Stay with him. I'll find out what happened. Extend to me your olive branch, and I will take the grove. is fragile enough. This was definitely poison. And Alcibiades wasn't the only victim. This proves it. Poison! 
It must have been added to the food and wine. This food smells strange, but it's not rotten. Supply list for the celebration. And the merchant's name. Time to pay this Priam a visit. Now, we're going to have a conversation. Please. Please, I, I was just doing what I was told. Now you'll do what I tell you. Oh, please. I thought we were just trying to make them slow. You know, so they lose. Win a few drachmi. My friend Alkibiadis may already be dead, and you're talking about drachmi. The golden boy? I was there. He didn't have much. If you can get him the antidote, he'll survive. Tell me where it is! They're sure to have it at Fort Koroibos. A man there paid me to do this. Look there! Whoever did this will pay. Go, and don't let me see your face again. Yes, thank you. Here's where you... <laughs> 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 This must be the antidote.
Here, I have the antidote. Mm. Oh, more wine, please, to wash away the taste. A treatment worthy of Hippocrates. I can already feel my stamina returning. <clears throat> Didn't you have one last fight in the Pancration? Let's go. Your next opponent is Dorios. Claims to be descended from Heracles himself. I'm ready. You ever faced an Olympic champion before? No, but I've gotten this far. Well, you don't look the part. You're not even oil for Zeus's sake. I do have some oil. It could come in handy, and it smelled good. I'll use it. Huh. You smell better than last time. Let's get this over with. For Ira. We've seen our esteemed newcomer rise quickly to become a contender. But let's see how she does against our reigning champion, Zoria! I will suck the marrow from your bones. It's not over yet! You'll have to try harder if you want to live!
I'm here to face the kings. Are you ready to take back our family's land? Of course. But my purpose here is to bring down the cultist king. You make your mother proud, Cassandra. But are you sure you have enough proof to accuse him? I'm sure. I'll gather the Ephors and meet you in the throne room. Who are the Ephors? You don't remember? Then again, you were only a child. The five Ephors are elected from the citizens of Sparta. They have power over even the kings. You need to convince them if you wish to save Sparta from the cult's control. See you in the throne room. <sighs> what are we waiting for? Sorry to keep you waiting. You summoned the Air Force? You must have achieved some success to earn this adoring crowd. I brought home a wreath for Sparta. Though, I had to enter the games and win it myself. Very good. But what of our Pankration champion, Testicles? There was an accident at sea before he could compete. Games are hardly important. What about Viotia? Stentor and I defeated the Athenian forces. You have nothing to worry about. If you have nothing but good news to share, why did you call for the Air Force? We were told serious charges would be brought. Serious charges? Against whom? You act as if you don't know. Against you, Pafsanias. Sparta must be rid of Pafsanias before it's too late. He is a member of the cult of Cosmos and a traitor a to Sparta. A Cosmos cult? What are you going on about? Is this some kind of joke? I have the proof right here. Your proof is right there. You know he's guilty. This isn't proof of anything. Ephos should only be called upon for serious matters. This lack of evidence is a waste of our time and disrespectful to the thrones of Sparta. The accuser should be made an example of for all other reckless fools. I taught her poorly. Punish me as her mother instead. We gave you every chance to prove yourself. Invited you back for a royal audience. And this is how you repay us? What say you, Archidamos? Cassandra and Marini of Agiad. Your names are cursed. May the Cryptia hunt you, and the Elote scrape the meat from your bones! Agreed. A wise ruling. Too bad you don't have a mask or a black cloak to save you this time. You were there, in Delphi. You're in the way! Move! Mother, Pafsanias revealed himself before I was dragged out of there. So he is the cultist king. It would be wise to deal with him as soon as possible. I will. When you've dealt with him, meet me at home. With pleasure. Ares has chosen me to lead the Spartans to glory. There can only be one. King Pafsanias is part of the cult of Cosmos. I'll have to kill him myself. Oh. 
Sandra, you are condemned to be hunted! I should have been more certain before accusing Pafsanias. He is a plague on Sparta and its territories. And you say you are sure now? Where is he, so he can defend himself? I watched him die. You murdered him? Yes. I found proof he was a member of the Cult of Cosmos. Undeniable proof. This letter was written and signed by Pafsanias' own hand, outlining the progress of their plans in Sparta. What is this Cult of Cosmos? You've mentioned them over and over, as if I should know. They're a secret group with one goal. To seize power. And they are using this war to strengthen their position. I find it difficult to think Papsineos was using Sparta this whole time. We've ruled together for years. I'll speak with the Air Force to confirm what you say. But if it's true, you deserve to be called a Spartan citizen once more. And of course, your family home is yours again. Thank you. One more thing. Yes? Should you decide to rule Sparta yourself, at least let me face you in battle. I'm not made for ruling, my king. It's gone. What's gone? There was a skull here, a small rabbit skull, from your first hunt. Why would someone take that? There is only one person who would have taken it. Nikolaos. Maybe seeing each other again made him think of this place. It did the same to me. Seems I wasn't the only one yearning for home. I hope I'm not intruding. Rasidas, come in. It's good to see the two of you back home. It feels good to be here. You're here instead of in training. What's wrong? I'm heading to Pilos as soon as I can. I think you may want to come as well. I'd be happy to return the favor. What's waiting for us in Pilos? Glory. The Athenians are pushing the Spartans back even as we speak. It would be a devastating loss for Sparta, and I can't allow that to happen. It sounds like you've lost confidence in Sparta's warriors. They're as strong as they've ever been. But now they're facing a power they can't even imagine. Do you mean Vimos? Yes, that's what the rumors say. A force of nature in the body of a mortal who can cut down any soldier in his path. If Vimos is in Pylos... We have to stop him. I'll wait for you at the ship, but be quick. Each moment we waste is another Spartan dead. 
Alexios is in Pilos. You have to bring him back, Cassandra. Bring him back? We have our home again. We can be a family. It isn't too late. I'll bring him back, no matter what. This is serious, Cassandra. We may not get another chance. I understand. He must have seen the cultists for what they truly are by now. It doesn't matter what you have to do. Bring back your brother. You must. Nothing will stop me. I shouldn't keep Vrasidas waiting. Be safe, Cassandra. Where's Brasidas? What do you want with him? We fought together. A friend? Yes, and a friend of Sparta. Now take me to him. Stop! I have orders. Stand guard and wait for reinforcements. They were due two nights ago. You can stop waiting. I've arrived. You? The Athenians are dogs at our throats. You won't talk so tough once you see them. I join you, and all they'll see is the ferryman. Ha! Well met, warrior. You better fight as good as you talk. Come, we go to Brasidas. A bad day for Athens! A glorious day for Sparta! And it is one you cannot win. If Brasidas dies, his blood is on your hands! He's yours and every one of your friends! Are you mad? We can still stop! No! We will not stop! I don't want to kill you, Alexio! But I will stop you! My name is Demos! Ah! <laughs> 
One of us will die. Isn't that the point? I found Mate. Finally reunited. Only to lose each other again! I don't know what you were thinking back there. What? Trying to save you? That's not what that was. I told you to stay out of my way. Yet here you are. So what? I'm a prisoner until I'm killed? That's the plan. Or I could come in there and end you anytime I please. But before that, tell me what you know. I thought your cultists told you everything. Sounds like you're on their side, but they're not on yours. You think I'm just a puppet? Then prove it to me. Tell me why I'm on the wrong side. Convince me. I dare you. What do you want to know? Everything you claim to be true. But after this, I kill you. Why was I abandoned that night on the mountain? Abandoned you? Is that what you call it? There's no other name for what you did to me. I was left to die. We tried to save you. They decreed my fate, and you accepted it. Mater went after you. What do you mean, after me? She went down the mountain to find you. She had to find you. And what did she find there? She brought you to a priest to be healed, but he told her you died. I wasn't her only child. Not everything was lost. No, all was lost. Everything we ever knew. What do you know? You know nothing of what I had to do. Listen, after you and the Elder fell, they threw me off Mount Taietos too. Pater, let me go. It was his duty. You were abandoned too? Yes. But we both survived. Against their wishes. We did. We're alive. Maybe it serves them right. Themos, we've been searching for you, and you are here. In the gutter. I hear it shouting. It's nothing. Leave. Now! This was not your action to take, boy. I am not your puppet. And you are not my master. Of course, champion. Any discretion I won't repeat. <sighs> Keep in mind, you put yourself in the cell. I don't recall doing that. You have to understand. This is all for Athens, Cassandra. Pericles would have impoverished the entire city. The people were living in squalor. So you had him murdered? You can't find the perfect yog without breaking some of the quail's eggs. He wasn't right for us. Killing your adversaries proves what kind of leader you are. Oh, I'm just getting started. If only you'd be around to watch. Come into the cell. You're here to kill me, aren't you? Let's see what happens. Fortunately for me, there are other fires I need to extinguish. I have heard word of revolt. Already? That was fast. I have a plan. They can't revolt if they're dead. I don't know how you can take on a band of rebels if you refuse to fight this one. The act itself is out of my hands. The vote has been cast. What did I tell you? The people have given me their blessing. 
I use their power. That's not democracy. The people have chosen their destiny, Cassandra. They've chosen me. Fuck you, Cleon. <laughs> I'm not alone in this. The people of Athens have spoken without me lifting a finger. That is how you treat rebellion. They don't know what they're agreeing to. You help me in Athens, even willingly. If only you were more like your brother now. A pity. The cult wins, Cassandra. Now, I have to see about the boat heading to Mytilene. Its people are in for a rude awakening. Interesting. Death may be the greatest of human blessings after all. Ah, at least you tried. Surely it's the thought that counts. Thank the gods you are alive, Cassandra. If those guards are not the last, I say we need to leave and do so quickly. Wait. We need to talk about Cleon. Socrates is on to that Malacca. We know what he is doing. Be brief. Her equipment, Varnavas. Come, Varnavas. Cassandra, meet us at Pericles' residence. There we'll discuss all we know. The steps to the Parthenon are long and built on corpses. 